show them the way out of your house. The Bible says every tree the Father has not planted shall be rooted out though. We are in the end time. I will call you back. I have one in you before me. Somebody come for counseling. That person is even crying. God will be praying for me that God will help me to counsel well like Solomon. No? Okay. What can we do for you? This one that you are crying. Please don't cry, yo. Baba. Baba, I'm pregnant. <laughs> I'm pregnant. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. <laughs> Osana. Thank you. God, we thank you. God has given you the fruit of the womb. Hallelujah to God in the highest. <laughs> This is not the thing of a shouting hallelujah, Baba. Huh. What many people are looking for you are still left alone for you are still crying. It is a thing of shame. Shame. Huh. Are you? No, 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 you want it to do. It's not a shameful thing. The Bible says that the fruit of the womb is his reward. I don't know what to do. Ah. If the nail on the head goes straight to the point, and you can lack your man as social because I know that you are here to your Lord. Go straight to where you are going to. Okay, Baba. And don't cry because in this house, every tree that the father has not planted shall be rooted out. The old go of tears and the old go of weeping shall be burned by fire. Baba. The person that got me pregnant said he's no more interested in me. Uh -huh. Why will your husband do that one? Why will your husband do that one? These are the men we are giving back to all. Eh? Why will I will show Kwenny? If you offend your husband, you can beg him to forgive you. Why will your husband say he doesn't want your pregnancy? Baba, he's not my husband. <laughs> yeah. What? what do you say? He's not yet my husband, but he's my fiancé. Yeah. So, Bafo, the calabash has broke. He now run. Fire he has hot. It's not your husband. You are, okay, you are in the relationship with the person you have not married. Yes, we are into coaching. Yeah. See? Fiancé. Fiancé means the person that you want to marry. Yes, Baba. Ah, light you have hot. He now run. Ah, this is a very critical you. So, it's your fiancé that eh, uh, blow your stomach. Yes, Baba. How come? Are you not a child of God, me? We are a child of God. Ha! Ah, so what happened? <laughs> he told me that in their family, that there is something they do to any lady they want to get married to, just for them to know if she's fat or not. Ha! Ah, what? Oh, what you say now? Say it again. I didn't understand. He said, the lady they must marry, it's a must they, they do what husband and wife does, so that they will know if she's father or not. Ah! They normally test people in their family. To test them to know if they are father or not. Which time do you become soup? Ah! They so mad by me or wife shall know your right or your love. So, they must test you first before they know if you are father or not. Which time do you become a wedding soup? Which time do you become a deep kaiko? Eh? Oh, a bonus soup. That they are testing you and you too, you are so gullible. You give yourself down to the testing of the people. You know, Baba. They want to test you to know maybe you are sweet. Ah! <laughs> there is fire on the mountain. Why is it that all of you that will come to a house? You don't bring peace. It's trouble. That will deliver me from trouble. Continue your story. Since he said is what they do in their, in their family, so that to text if I'm fat or not, I had to agree because I can't stand the shame. Is someone that will soon be my husband, so I can't I can't stand the shame. I had to go go. Ha! He said you were a love. So you love him so much. That's why you gullible to the point to the problem. Ha! Love is very blind. And you allow the love that is blind to blind your eyes to spiritual things. The love immediately blind your eyes to Bible principle. The love blind your eyes to what the Bible says about the bed being undefined. And you find yourself in that man. 
Baba. I don't know what to do. I just have to come, come. Come. When you say all this thing, you don't go and meet this man, Tony. The person, the, the man of God that is upon this relationship, is supposed to go and look for somebody that you will tell you that this my man, no, you have gone to jail. That's why we normally tell you that you are watching at home. That you want to marry. Make sure that the man of mentor. Make sure that the man you want to marry has somebody that you say yes are for. I don't mean that the person should not tell you and ask him, what's your mentor? And he will not say, my mentor is John Maxwell. No. My mentor is Riabonke. No. Riabonke is everybody mentor. John Maxwell is everybody mentor. I mean the person that when you can call the person, he will answer. You must know the person mentor. Say your husband will have mentor. You didn't go and meet your mentor. Ni. Baba, he has a mentor. Uh -huh. And I went to him. He told me. He said there's nothing bad in it. Yeah! Of me, I yet to the end of time he has come. In fact, do you know end of time? You don't know it. He's knocking on your door. <sighs> the mentor said that he's okay. Hey, don't let me react. Don't let me react. That, that mentor is, is a carpenter. He's a bricklayer. Oh, is it, is it from the church of God? He's a man of God, Baba. Uh, mm -mm. Church of God. I am not a man of God. Mama, I know God. Yeah? Me tell me, man of God. <laughs> hey, in you know, bro. Fire here, son. There is fire and the man. <laughs> okay? The matter is from the church of God. Hey, Rinka. The Bible says, in the multitude of counselors, there is safety. And now we have counselor and mentor. Now they have become tormentor. So the man that is the mentor from the church of God said that there's nothing but the needs. So Continue. Baba. Baba. When my fiancé told me about it. He says since I'm still going to get married to him, it will be between her, my fiancé, and our mentor. Okay. So I listened. Ah, oh God. Ah, oh God. <laughs> ah, so what happened again? Whenever it rains. Wait, oh, when? Tomorrow, where are you for? Yes. And rain. Hey, we call you. That you should come and pack your clothes, or you should come and wash. For to do what? My my face he calls me to to warm him up. Hey, to warm him up. Ah, hey. Holy Spirit, come and save your soul. Where are you for? He will call you to come. And, which time do you become shakopat? Or which time do you become ina edu? Uh, which time do you become heat? Are you heat? To warm me up. Ah, huh, my Lord Jesus. You know, the Bible says that when man and woman come together, they will keep themselves warm. That they will be heat. That is what I am. Ha! Yeah. Ah. Yes, if not because my hand is far from where you are sitting, I will slap your face. You'll be seeing joker dreams, slather, climb you up and down. The Bible says when you come together, there is heat. And you now use that one to answer the question of rain. I where am for? I will not call that Bible. The Bible says when you come together, you want it will come. And you come, eh? It is there. Maybe that's the heat you are carrying now. I'll be what else? We need it often and often. Ah, hey, hey, hey. it's not a mistake. <laughs> we are addicted to it. Okay. Ah. <laughs> Continue. So, the result is that I'm pregnant now. Uh, uh. He rejected the pregnancy. He said he's not more interested. Hey, yeah. Oh, Korea, you smart. You say smart guy. Do you mean uh, I'm carrying 
four children in me. Ah, how my mom go? My God, my ah, no wonder the brother see that you are gullible. That's why he do what he do. I mean that when you add two plus two, two and two, I wrote two or two. You add your something foolishness to your annoying person foolishness to give you the foolishness in your stomach. Oh. <laughs> So what is my own idea again, Papa? Baba, I need your advice. I don't want to be like this, please, Baba. What should I do? Ah, hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Baba, you need to advise me. I don't know what to do. Serious, I'm that useless. The advice is supposed to come and ask for you allow Ronaldo to score. You did not collection. Ronaldo now score. You're not asking for advice. Well. Me, what I will say is this, the Bible says that there is hope for a tree that is cut down, they will sprout again. <laughs> Abortion is not an option. You have carried it, you have carried it, you have carried Dumbo, you have carried the parent. So God will give you the grace to carry it for life. You did not look for your man, you didn't find him at all, me. I called him, can you imagine? Bro, Samson did not pick my call anymore. He said, Baba, he said, he said he's not more interested in me and he's not even living at his place anymore. I don't know what to do. <laughs> hey, Samson Alagora. Ah, that's the Samsonic anointing. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Huh? Hold it on. That man is very smart. Oh, go back, eh? He quickly donate electron and run away. Papa, papa. <coughs> Covenant bond the total, see? God will help your destiny, yo. Why don't you go to your mentor at least to tell him what is happening about the you now? What did your mentor say? I I went back to his mentor. He, he said he said he's no more picking his calls and he even left the church. Ah, you see, he's no more coming to a church. That person was not a member of the church in the first place. That man is star. That man is very smart. Ah. The brother is a, is a wolf. That brother is a wolf from the world. And he come to shores, use suit and tie to package himself to get the daughter of Zion. That one is a wolf. Ah, that one is a Ronaldo. <laughs> ah, ah, eh, that is your cross. You are the one that we carry in it. You will go and pray that God will help you. You ask for forgiveness of sin, number one. That God should forgive you for your foolishness. Then after that, you will fall out. Give back to your baby. After that, you will not pray that God will restore you. It's possible that God will restore you, and that is it. For all of you that you are looking at me at home, before I send this one away, you can to sanctify that share. All of you looking at me at home, listening to me very well, you can learn from this experience. Why will somebody tell you that you must test you before marriage? That person is not a child of God in the first place. That person is a wolf. That person is a wolf among the sheep. Look, not every brother wearing suit and tie. He's a, he's a sheep, oh. Some of them are looking for whom to defer, oh. And not every sister wearing shirts a long skirt. He's a daughter of Zion. Some of them are finding people to ash. If anybody be telling you, come, let us do it before marriage, run away. It's not the will of God. If any mentor call himself man of God from the church of God, now we have mentors and we have tormentors. If they tell you, go on, there's nothing bad there, run from them all. Leave them alone, yo. Are you getting me? Don't fall into this mess and mistake. And some of you, you are in relationship and there is real fall. And you are feeling cold. And you'll be shaking, shaking, shaking. The next thing you carry your phone, you will call hello. Hello, my dear. Hello, sweetheart, I'm feeling cold. I think woman, all they are in there do. And the only thing that can calm down their temperature is when they come to your house and they give you tingas. Which time did they become temperature karma or temperature giver? And if you seem able to say when to come together, you are going to have heat. You must come and see that person. You have told yourself to in there do, and you warm yourself up. And after you do that well, what do you carry? You carry the shame of pregnancy before the wedlock. The Bible says marriage is honorable unto a man, but the bed only 